uh, two great New players, and Kate Bakey will serve to start us off. Get a good look at that two-handed backhand pass, though. Alex, she loves that shot. Well, especially up the line on that on that two. It's a shot she's going to make more times than not. It's such a great deep Point. serve there Point. by Kate. Alex could not do anything with the return, therefore stayed back and was in a tough position from the start there. And we've seen Point. two consecutive points. Two zero. Trong not coming up to the kitchen line after the return. We'll see if that continues. Point. Correctly called just long. I agree with that. So really good pressure here by Kate. Coming off strong here in game one. Three zero. And just a nice defensive effort there from Trong, but just the pressure from Fahey, like you said, Dave. Just too much getting up to the kitchen line, dictating points so far. I think Alex is going to change your strategy here, Will, and return and come in and put the pressure on Kate. The referee is going to agree with that call, so now let's get the ball in her hands here, Will, and try to get on the board here early. 2-1-0-4 here. Chance to get on the board here. What a shot there. That's just great touch there. I mean, Kate hit a pretty good ball. And just terrific hands there by Alex. One of the things that makes her such a great doubles player is she's got really soft, what I call sensitive feel on the touch of the paddle. And that's that good pressure that we were talking about earlier that she needs to do to Kate like what Fahey was doing to Alex early in those first three points. And I like the way that she kind of waited until right before Kate hit the ball to kind of come in after that shot. It wasn't like, hey, just hit and sprint in. She kind of saw she had the advantage and slowly made her way up to the kitchen line. Fight out. Just out there, that cross-court forehand by Alex looked like a really good swing and impact just sails long by a ball. Point. Point. Yeah, Kate loves that inside out forehand where the ball goes away from the player. So it's bouncing and spinning away from Alex. So even if Alex gets that ball back, she's completely out of position Point. for the Five next two. shot. It's going to go way out. So Point. a little greedy Five there. And I think you're going to see a timeout here by Alex. Not super surprised. 6 2. I have bad bunions. Wish they'd disappear. Sir, future me. And no bunions! How? Lapoplasty. Lapoplasty corrects bunions at the source, meaning you're back in sneakers in weeks. Lapoplasty. Weeks! The future of bunion surgery is here. Learn more at lapoplasty.com. Risks include infection, pain, and loss of correction. Thanks so much for joining us. I like that Alex picked that right ball to attack and come in. I think she's got to look for that opportunity to come to that kitchen line and put the pressure on Kate. I think if she, Kate keeps her back, it's just a huge competitive advantage for Fahey. and didn't try to overhit that ball. It's really easy to want to put that away with her style, but just hit it. Worked with good margins. Uh, terrific round strokes by both of these ladies. You know, you and I were talking pre-match about Kate's doubles game, how she's teamed up with Anna Bright a few times, both on the PPA tour, of course, with MLP. And 
that's been that stays in for Fahey. Speaking of women's doubles, Fahey and Trong are actually playing women's uh, women's doubles later on today. I'm gonna have to put that to the side for now, though. <laughs> Great storyline. And that forehand down the line just sails wide. So another side out here for Fahey. See if Trong were to get off two. She's been on two for a few side outs. Look to change that, cut into this lead. Two seven. Two, two. Side out. And I think Kate stayed back there because it was a short, kind of a weaker return to Alex's forehand and Trong not able to take advantage of that. Point. Seven two. Uh, you can't afford to give freebies like that. Not when you're down 7 2, Will. And make it 8 2. 8 2. Side out. Side out. That one overcooked there from Fahey. Kick Fahey, a uh, college Two, tennis star at University of Michigan. Two, uh, one of the few we have on tour. Also, Brooke Buckner comes to mind. Michigan Wolverine. Yep, and Matt Wright on the men's side played. Uh, Four years for, for Michigan, for his uh, undergrad. Three, we'll see Matt and Lucy later, I believe, on the grandstand court. They're our first mixed doubles match. They'll play Hunter Johnson and Paris Todd. That'll be a fun one. Oh, yeah. Four more. Boy, Fahey doing a great Five job out. fighting off the sun on that lob from Alex. And you saw her not kind of, she didn't wind up fully. She just kind of did what she had to do to get it in the court. Stay alive and eventually come out on Eight, top. Three. She had total control of the point, so she didn't have to get too greedy on that overhead. One point. Just a miss hit there by. Four, one. Early nine three lead here in game one and make that Point. ten. A few missed returns, four, three or four we've had in this first game. And I'm not super surprised to see a timeout here yeah. from Trong. For the time so far in game one, Will, the game pressure's point. really been on, on Alex. Exactly. So Fahey serving at game point on the top of your screen. That is going to do it. Kate Fahey, 11 3 over Alex Strong. She's one game away from.
bigger hill to climb if you're Alex Strong. Yeah, and Alex has to realize, I think the wind is helping.